You're gonna have probably ever so slightly inconsistencies when the paper feeds out and hits your nip, your rollers, where your laminate is. It's not the feeder that will be inconsistent. It'll be just how each of the sheets land in there because you're not gonna be able to make it perfect, but I mean, you should be within an eighth of an inch, probably on every single one, easily. Now, if I adjusted the conveyor belt and this wheel right here and got everything perfect, the feeder itself is feeding exactly every time consistently on. There, there is no variation in the feeder, how it's feeding. Any variation you're watching is, is strictly related to the conveyor, possibly a slight curl in the paper, how it hits the wheel right there on the conveyor, how the sheet slides onto the conveyor belt. That's where any consistency would occur, would be there. Plus there's ever so slightly differences in the power. The conveyor belt is plugged into 120. The feeder's plugged into 120. So as the power goes up and down, the conveyor belt and the feeder are gonna be speeding up because they're not linked together mechanically. 